Hey guys, I'm Mallory Ames. I'm a part of the Philo 4-H Friends 4-H Club and today I'm going to be showing you how to prep your photography projects for show. So I'm going to start by talking about regular photography, so photography 1, 2, and 3. So when you're preparing your project, take hundreds and hundreds of photos and then go back later and figure out which one looks best, which one you like the most, which one you think would show the best. Choose a picture that looks nice and then you have to frame it. Your frame can be black, white, gray, whatever color you want, but it has to be an 8x10. Frame it in something pretty, don't do something that's got a bunch of scratches all over it or something you wouldn't want the judges to see. If you're in photography 3, portraits is a big deal. So portraits, you want to look at their smile, their facial complexion, their clothes, the colors behind them, the background. All that's kind of a really big deal to figure out when you're trying to choose your picture. When you're doing photo editing, the big deal is not necessarily what the picture looks like in the beginning, but what it looks like in the end. This was my photo editing project last year, and when you're trying to show it, the first thing you have to do is show the original picture. It can be a small picture, a wallet size picture, anything really, but you want to show the original picture with no editing when you took it because you want to show the major amount of editing that you did to make it the picture it is. When you're doing photo editing, a big thing is to know what software you're using. Are you using Photoshop? And then you need to know what you did to the picture. Did you clone people? Did you change colors? Did you remove things? Did you add things? All that kind of stuff is really important when you're talking to the judge. For this picture, judges asked me about the person that was in the shadows in the back of my picture. Did I clone them out? How did I get them out of the picture? Did I just cut them out? All that kind of stuff is really important. And then Colors. Colors is a big deal. When you're using Photoshop, you use layers. And so they'll ask you about the different layers you put onto the picture and all that kind of stuff is really important. When you get up to the judging, make sure that you're presentable, you look nice, you're talking loud, you're making conversation. Know what kind of camera you have. Know the shutter speed that you used when you took the shot, the ISO. All that kind of stuff is really important to know because that shows the judge that you took the picture and someone else didn't take the picture. Just try to keep a conversation go. Explain why you chose that photo. Explain what the meaning is behind that photo, like who the person is in the photo. All that kind of stuff is really important when you're talking to the judge. Also, have a story behind your picture because if you don't have a story, it's like there's no meaning behind the picture and then it's just a picture. There's no memory to remember the picture for the rest of your life. So those are some tips on keeping your photo editing and photography projects ready for the fair. Thanks for listening and good luck at the fair.